welcome back. In today's video, I wanted to show off this colorful, crazy pattern blazer that I'm wearing. I got this from Shein for, don't remember the price, but I will put it on the screen. <laughs> It, it was cheap though, it was cheap. And I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw this, it did catch my eye, but not in a, ooh, I love it. Oh my God, it's beautiful type of way, you know what I mean? It was more of a, wow, that's different. That's a statement. But after thinking about it and deliberating for so long, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get it. And here's why. Usually I get so nervous to buy pieces that I feel are different than what I'm used to because one, it's kind of outside of my comfort zone, it's outside of what I'm used to, but also two, I feel like I'm gonna buy it and then feel like I have absolutely nothing to wear with it and it's just gonna sit in my closet. So it's like, oh, you know what I mean? Um, so I decided, you know what, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna take the risk and I bought it. That's what I did. So soon after it came, I was like, you know what, I'm not gonna let it just sit there. I'm gonna look for outfits. Okay, I'm gonna look through the clothes I already own to see what I can put with this blazer because this is, this blazer's just like, there's a lot going on here. So you definitely don't need anything that's super over the top because you don't wanna look like a hot mess. You don't wanna look really like. So I did manage to find four looks that worked very well with this blazer. So I thought I'd share them all with you. Let's jump into the video. So for look number one, I decided to pair the blazer up with this romper. The romper is also from Shein as well. I bought this though last summer and I've actually never worn it because you know, we're in a whole pandemic, I wasn't really going anywhere. But I am gonna wear this because this look is a vibe and I paired it with my Air Forces. It's just a whole vibe, I love it. I love it. And for girls that are like, when you wear super tight things like a romper like this or a um, like a tight mini dress, some girls don't like having you know their whole physique. Or like not that they don't like it, but they're not super comfortable with it. So throwing a long blazer on like this, one, as a pop of color because you're wearing black, but also two, it gives you that added comfort because you're covered, you don't feel like you're super exposed. And you know what, ladies? There's nothing wrong with that. You can love mini dresses and you can love uh, rompers, but also feel uncomfortable in them at the same time because that's me 100%. So, no judgment. We all go through it. But yeah, this is a vibe. A whole vibe. So for look number two, I went with a white cropped short sleeve shirt. Also from Shein, oh my god, wait! And my jeans are from... <laughs> this is too funny. My shorts are also from Shein. Um, I decided to pair this together because honestly, let me tell you, I did not try any of these outfits on um, before filming this. I was just kind of picturing it in my mind and I was like, you know what, this might be a vibe. This outfit in particular is my favorite of the four. It kind of just gives me this like artsy vibe. Like, it's like... Yeah, she's artsy. I like her. I like what she's doing. I like what she's got going on. And then like the two pigtails too with it. It's like, that is a vibe. Also, this outfit, you can wear like casually. You're gonna hang out with your friends at the park or maybe not a park, but you go into the city just to like walk around, shop. I don't know. You can wear this depending on your field of work. Like if you're in a more artsy type of place, not an office setting where you're in a suit, like you can wear this for like, like a little work meeting type thing. Maybe not the shorts, but a little too short. But if you're an artist, yes you can. Yes you can. <laughs> you can wear this for a date. I would so wear this for a date. This is like a daytime date outfit, I'd say. Perfect for spring. Perfect for summer, like because this blazer is really thin. It is not thick at all, so it's good. Once again, ladies, if you love short shorts but are a little uncomfortable wearing them because you feel super exposed, bam, this is what the blazer is for because the blazer is long and it covers. Even though the shorts are not that short, but it's a whole vibe. It's a whole lot. I freaking love this. This is, so far, two out of four outfits down and I'm really happy with my bridges. Like, I'm so happy. So for outfit number three, I chose to pair this blazer with this bandeau top, which is also from Shein. 
This was not planned, you guys. I just picked stuff and it just happened to be from the same brand. Um, but yeah, this, I actually turned it around because it says fearless in white across the front. And I didn't think that was a vibe for the blazer. Um, so I just turned it around so that it can be fully black. And I paired it with this cute pencil skirt from H&M and my chuck because, hello. Truly, what is this called, Scorpio? No. I think Scorpion is like something like that and I should not do that because I will break my back. So with this outfit, I was I was a little hesitant about and kind of still am kind of sorta so, sorta <laughs> sort of. Um and here's why. The so pencil skirts are long, right? And then this blazer is long. Now if the blazer was shorter, I don't think I would question it at all because I like it. I like the blade the blay. <laughs> I cannot talk today, guys. I like the gray and black combo, and I feel like with these colors, it's not too much. At least for me, it's not too much. So I was like, okay, if it was shorter, definitely would wouldn't even question it. However, because this is long, right? And the pencil skirt is long, that's why I was like. I'm not sure how I'm feeling about it. I don't know. But then I went like this in the mirror. Let me tell you guys. I was staring at myself in the mirror and I went like this. And I was like, oh, it's a vibe, honey. <laughs> because I don't know what it was about that pose, that position, but it changed my mind completely. And I was like, oh, so if you do a little, little cute little sweet back, like, bam. It's a whole vibe. So. Hmm. I like it. Outfit number three, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so last but not least for outfit number four, I paired this blazer with this beige bodysuit from Forever 21 and these high-waisted jeans from Hollister and my cute crocodile boots from Shoe Dazzle. And honestly, this is another one of those outfits that's a whole vibe. Like, it's a vibe. You guys are you feeling what I'm feeling are you seeing what I'm seeing it's a vibe so for this outfit I feel like you can dress it up and you can dress it down so listen to me hear me out if you wear this to work right because I don't know if you can wear jeans to work I'm jealous because I wish I could wear jeans to work I can't but if you can wear jeans to work you can throw on this outfit right and then let's say you got a date afterward or you're going out for drinks with some friends or co-workers afterward, you know, and you want to zhuzh it up a bit, bam, put some heels on. All you gotta do is put heels on, and this outfit looks completely different. You're ready to go. So it's one of those like day to night outfits, so I like that. It's a vibe. It's cool. It's casual. I would also wear this um, to run errands. It's totally comfortable. It's like, it's not too much. So this piece, honestly, in conclusion, I feel like this piece is just so versatile. You can do so much with this blazer. So I'm really, really happy I decided to get this because like I said before, I was questioning it. I was like, <laughs> I was debating. But I'm really, really happy that I got this. This is, um, this is definitely cool. I'm, I'm so happy. But I really want to know what your thoughts are, so be sure to comment down below. Let me know which outfit you were feeling, which outfit you were like, eh, what's this? Come on, let's, let's, let's think about that. Okay, let's, let's think. Um, but yeah, I really want to know your opinion, so let me know in the comments down below. Please subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.